The Force is with you, young Skywalker. But you are not a Jedi yet. Hey, what up, YouTube fam? It's Dupree, aka Darth Hater, here with some brand new, fresh Star Wars news for you. But before we get into it, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe, and also check out my last video because it greatly helps out the channel. So let's get into it. So by now, most of you have seen the Ahsoka trailer that dropped during Star Wars Celebration a couple weeks ago. The trailer introduced a lot of new things. It introduced a live action version of most of the Star Wars Rebels crew, Harrison Dula, Sabine Wren, Chopper again, even a hologram of Ezra Bridger. And it also introduced a lot of new characters. Two end up being these two Jedi who were found out to be dark Jedi by the names of Balin Skull, played by Ray Stevenson, and Shin Hati, played by Ivana Sakano, both of whom who actually wield orange, not red, lightsabers. It was described at the celebration panel that these were dark Jedi, Jedi who survived the purge. Balin Skull is actually the master of Shin Hati and they both fall under Grand Admiral Thrawn's rule. We also see in this trailer Ahsoka dueling another Force-sensitive lightsaber-wielding person. This person actually has a double-bladed red lightsaber, and if you look closely, you can see that this is an Imperial Inquisitor. Which one of the Inquisitors, you ask? We don't know just of yet. And seeing as this is set during the New Republic era, has to be a inquisitor that we have yet seen the speculation right now goes that this is actually probably barris ofi now if you guys remember barris ofi was a jedi who turned against the jedi order during the end of the clone wars and tried to set ahsoka tano up thus being the reason that she left the jedi order after it was found out by anakin skywalker that barris ofi set her up and after that, we never heard from or saw Barris Ophi again. So this potentially could be Barris Ophi in live action to tie up that whole loose end of where she could have been after the Clone Wars, now into the New Republic. We also know that a lot of Ahsoka will deal with going back to different eras in the Star Wars timeline, mainly back into the Clone Wars. So this could be ahsoka going back and fighting barris ofi by use of the world between worlds a portal into different dimensions or different timelines this in the fact is actually how ahsoka survived her duel with darth vader in star wars rebels by being pulled through a portal from ezra bridger and it's also been known that Ahsoka will go back to Clone Wars and the prequels timeline and be on Mustafar with Anakin and that whole confrontation and everything will be switched around. But I could be wrong. They could be all working together. The two Dark Jedi, Ray Stevenson's character and Ivana Scano could all be working together with this other dark side user. But anyway, let me know what you guys think about this mass red lightsaber wielding person is let me know in the comments down below and as always if you guys like this video please hit that like button if you're not subscribed to the channel hit the subscribe button and don't forget to hit that bell to get notifications for all my latest videos that would be great anyway guys take care see you in the next one may the force be with you bye